Right, so while the wife's at work, I've got my brother-in-law here, he's a carpet fitter, and I had an idea to replace her car road mats with these kids' play mats. <laughs> <All right. laughs> Apparently he knows what he's doing. But yeah, Joe's gonna cut these out from the mats, and then he's gonna glue them on top of her existing mats. And then we'll put them in her car, and then, I don't know, when she gets home, I'll say to her, you go grab something out your car for me, and then we'll see what she thinks. Now I must say, at this point in the video, me and Joe, we was looking at these thinking, oh, you know what? These actually look rather good. <laughs> we was even saying, do you know what? I reckon we could start a business out of selling these, because these just look fucking sick, in my opinion. You know, it was meant to be a joke, these childish mats. But instead, they just felt more like nostalgia than a joke. Right, and now just do the same thing all over again. But whether it's meant to be a prank or not, we've already started and we've got to finish it now. And if you're wondering, this prank cost us about 45 pound-ish. Oh, that shit, then I think it's already open. It was open. Oh, shoot, first one. That's perfect. Do you know what? I really like that. Yeah. <laughs> Let's get the next one in. They are, they are really good. I'm kind of worried that this ain't going to be a prank and she's actually going to like it. <laughs> yeah. All right, when she gets home, we'll find out. Oh, do us a favor. Dog food, back of your car. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> oh, what do you think? I like it. What? Fuck, I told you. I told you she'd like it. It's about us. Yeah, I said after we did it, this probably weren't going to be a prank. It was more of a... Actually quite cool. I like it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we have to do mine now. Uh, the fucking waste of time. <laughs>